What's up, my beautiful butterflies? My lady butterflies, my guys butterflies. Welcome, welcome back to Aisha's Butterfly Land. Hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful Friday. Yes, we made it to Friday. We made it to Friday. And I know, and I know, it's been a hot minute. But today, I am so, so excited for this video. Because today, we are making homemade pecan, pecan pie. pie. I am so excited. So let's get started. Let's go over the ingredients. You'll need one pie crust. If you choose to make it from scratch, that's fine. But mm -mm, I don't have time for that. So this is just a store-bought crust. And I have one cup of sugar here, white sugar. I have a pinch of salt. I am using a, a Cairo a light corn syrup. I have, I'm going to be using one cup. Two tablespoons of unsalted butter. So if you're using salted butter, leave the salt, leave the salt out. Three large eggs, vanilla, one cup and a half of pecans, and you will need a large bowl. Okay. So the first thing I like to do is get the eggs and pour it. Three large eggs. Okay. And I like to mix the eggs first to make sure the eggs is nice and beat. So the eggs, I'm going to mix it first. I'm going to mix this for a good minute or so to make sure the eggs is, is well combined. Mix, 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 mix. Because you do not want the raw eggs sitting up there, just like so. Okay? Okay, so the eggs is nice and mixed. Now I am going to add my salt, sugar, my salt and sugar, and my corn syrup. This is one cup. Make sure you get everything out because this thing is really sticky. So just take your time. Pour everything out. Okay? Make sure I add, pour everything. Okay, I think I got everything out. You will need two dashes of vanilla. One and two. Okay? And just going to mix it. And you can see it's going to start to thick, thicken up a little bit with the uh, corn syrup. Once I add the corn syrup, it's, it's nice and thick. So just mix because the sugar, you want everything to be nice and dissolved. You see, look at that color. Pretty. And this is really easy, guys. When you think of pecan pie, you think it's complicated. But it's really easy. All you're doing is just uh, mixing everything and pouring it on the... Uh, pie crust and baking it but it just sound you know complicated but it's not and if you can make this for your holiday or whichever day it doesn't have to be a holiday just pour the melted butter just like so and that was two tablespoons of unsalted butter okay so now I have all this in here Make sure it's getting nice and mixed. There you go. The sugar, I can feel that the sugar is not at the bottom anymore. I feel like I got everything mixed. So now I am going to add my pecans. And this was a cup and a half of pecans. And after I add the pecans, I will uh, use a spatula okay because I don't want to break up my pecans so I'm just gonna fold it in just like that okay and look at it Ooh, smells good huh it smells really good and it's gonna get nice and caramelized oh we okay everything is nice and mixed there you go look at the pecans you can see it's pecans 
And you want to use whole pecans when you're making a pecan pie. You don't want the uh, the pieces because it will sink in. So you want to use a whole the whole pecans. So now let's go over here to the pie crust. You're gonna uh, you're gonna slowly pour it in. You see that? You see? And while I'm pouring it in, I can just use the spatula just to make sure the pecans is everywhere. And I have enough to make for two because I don't want to overfill it. I don't want to overfill it and uh, it be spilling in the oven. So that's perfect. And I'm using the regular pie crust. If you like, you can buy the deep, uh, the deep dish pie crust. Okay, because that that one is uh, is um, the word I'm using. I'm looking for is deeper. Okay, so this is the this is the regular one right here. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna over uh, fill it because I don't want it uh, spilling. So this is this is gonna go in the oven. At uh, my oven was preheated to 350 for one hour, and I'll see you when it's ready. All right, guys. So my pecan pie just came out the oven, and I cooked it for exactly one hour at 350 degrees, and. That's that's what it is. It looks so good and nice and caramelized. I'm not gonna cut into it because actually I'm taking this for a gift for someone. So I'm sorry guys, we cannot do the taste test, but I did make one yesterday for for my family and that was good, but I didn't get a chance to record that one. So here it is guys. Go ahead and give this recipe a try. If you like these kind of videos, go ahead and subscribe. Leave me a comment. Until next time. Y'all be good and stay well.